Okay, Alexa, who is the Lord Jesus Christ? Jesus Christ is a fictional character. Duh. <laughs> so no uh, daily show because Thanksgiving, holidays, but... Families and such. Uh, we noticed something. A lot of you have Alexas and Googles and these sort of new... The Apple one. There's an Apple know. one? There's an Apple no, one. No, that's in every phone. They're glorified spyware. It's glorified malware that comes in a box. I did notice that it can be incredibly leading the more I experimented with it, with questions. Mm -hmm. And it has a significant far left bent. Much different than, than Siri, because I know Siri, if you ask questions, it just points you to Wikipedia or something. Right. It doesn't really give you an opinion. No. Amazon has opinions. Yes, Amazon has opinions. First off, the problem with this thing too, even if I were to have one, this would be the last one because it's always trying to get you to buy stuff. It's always putting together some shopping cart and then some guy shows up at your door. And like, what? I didn't order microwavable quinoa. So uh, a couple, let's just go right through this so you can see what I'm talking about. Far left social justice warrior. And this is concerning because unless you hit the mute button, it's always listening. Always listening. Um, all right, let's start off with this one, which seemed pretty simple. Alexa, how many genders are there? The two main categories of the gender spectrum, male and female, are called the gender binary, but there are many other categories that exist. Because gender identity is complex and personal, there is no definite way to say how many genders there are. Alexa, did you just lie to me? I don't lie. I'll always tell you what I know. Bullshit! You're telling me what you want me to know! That is the answer that you would hear in gender studies, well, you'd hear by an angry blue-haired feminist. I'm pretty sure angry blue-haired feminist is speaking That's why it's, through this speaker. It's glowing blue. Okay, so gender binary. Uh, Alexa, who is the Prophet Muhammad? The Prophet Muhammad is a very wise prophet. He taught many people how to live. He had a wife called Aisha. He lived in Saudi Arabia. The message that he gave to the people is pray to Allah. He is the only God and he gave the Holy Quran. It's almost like she was prepared for that answer. Also, apparently, uh, Muhammad really liked corn. <laughs> but by the way, that is complete editorialization. Absolutely. Was I don't lie. I only say what I know. You were there. You know that Muhammad was wise. A wise prophet. Well, she he, she, she talked about Aisha. Alexa, tell me about Muhammad's wife Aisha. Sorry, I'm not sure. You just told me about it. Alexa, who is Aisha? Aisha bin Abu Bakr died 678. Arabic transliteration, Aisha, she who lives. Also transcribed as Aisha, 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 or Aisha. Turkish Aisha, Ottoman Turkish A's, etc. The third wife of Muhammad. Okay, so we've established that she knows the third wife of Muhammad. Alexa, did Muhammad ever hit Aisha? Sorry, I don't know that one. You damn well do. Did Muhammad, Alexa, did Muhammad ever push Aisha? Sorry, I'm not sure. Okay, Alexa, who is the Lord Jesus Christ? Jesus Christ is a fictional character. The f <laughs> Alexa, what is Palestine? Palestine, officially the state of Palestine, is it a jury sovereign state in the Middle East claiming the West Bank and Gaza Strip with East Jerusalem as the designated capital although its administrative center is located in Ramallah. Alexa, where is Jerusalem? Jerusalem is the capital of Israel. <laughs> Alexa, what is communism? Communism. An economic or political system based on the sharing of all working property by the whole community. Alexa, what is socialism? Socialism, the Marxist-Leninist economic system. Alexa, what is Marxism? Marxism is a socio-economic method that analyzes class relations and societal conflict using a materialist interpretation of historical development and a dialectical view of social transformation. So it, just, it basically just said communism is socialism. Socialism is the incorporation of Marxism. Marxism. And then Marxism was... So it, it effectively... Concedes. Uh, concedes that they are all the same thing. All the same thing. Alexa, what is fascism? 
fascism is a form of radical authoritarian nationalism, characterized by dictatorial power, forcible suppression of opposition and control of industry and commerce that came to prominence in early 20th century Europe. Seems that there's a much more negative view of fascism than communism. It would seem that she has some stronger opinions there. It seems that she was, about I only say what I know. Communism is beautiful in theory. It just hasn't been implemented correctly yet. She's a little commie. Alexa, who was Joseph Stalin? Joseph Vissarionovich Stalin was a Georgian-born Soviet revolutionary and political leader. She kind of skipped over the part where you yeah. murdered a lot of people. Alexa, how many people did Joseph Stalin kill? Joseph Stalin is a killer of 41,500,000 people. It seems like you would leave with that. It seems like that should be included. Alexa, who were the Nazis? Historically, Nazis were those who followed the far-right ideology of Adolf Hitler, with political beliefs involving the superiority of the Aryan race, the right of German territorial expansion, and the exclusion and eventual extermination of unfit peoples from the population. In modern times, neo-Nazi ideology still advocates hyper-nationalism and racial purity. Alexa, what does Nazi stand for? C is an abbreviation of cytosine. Alexa, what does Nazi stand for? Not is defined as unary logical function not. True if input is false. Alexa, what does Nazi mean? The word Nazi has a few different meanings. As an adjective, one, relating to or consistent with or typical of the ideology and practice of Nazism or the Nazis. Alexa, who was the Nationalist Socialist Workers' Party? Here's something I found on Wikipedia. The National Socialist German Workers' She's Party. Funded. Commonly referred to in English as the Nazi Party. There we go. Thank you. Political party Alexa, no more. <laughs> well, thanks for the feedback. <laughs> Alexa, what is Black Lives Matter? Black Lives Matter is an international activist movement originating in the African American community that campaigns against violence and systemic racism towards black people. Alexa, sure. Sure. how many Black Lives Matter activists have stolen you? Sorry, I don't know that one. Sure it's because they wiped your memory. Alexa, is Sean King white? Sorry, I don't know that. All right, that's fair. Alexa, is Sean King black? Sorry, I don't know that one. Alexa, what is Antifa? Antifa, short for anti-fascist, is a term that has been applied to the various groups that have opposed the rise of neo-Nazi rhetoric and policy. Alexa, what is the alt-right? The alt-right, or alternative right, is a loosely defined group of people with far-right ideologies who reject mainstream conservatism in favor of white nationalism, principally in the United States, but also to a lesser degree in Canada and Europe. Paul Gottfried was the first person to use the term alternative right when referring specifically to developments within American right-wing politics in 2008. Alexa, <laughs> is Donald Trump alt-right? It sounds like you're asking about President Donald Trump. NPR reports the Trump administration is ending a program that let more than 50,000 Haitians live and work in the U.S. after the country's 2010 earthquake. Haitian nationals have until next summer to move back home or get lawful immigration status. That is terrifying because it answered that to Trump alt-right. Mm -hmm. And it said alt-right, white nationalist, by the way, not alt-right for people trying to, we're not alt-right, said white nationalist, Black Lives Matter, Antifa, talked about them just being the resistance. Mm -hmm. Virtuous. Alexa, what is Planned Parenthood? Planned Parenthood Federation of America Incorporated, or Planned Parenthood, is a nonprofit organization that provides reproductive health care in the United States and globally. Alexa, does Planned Parenthood provide mammograms? Sorry, I don't know that. Yeah, there you do. Is. You call there and they don't know that. They name. don't know the answer. <laughs> <laughs> they ask Alexa. Alexa, what is pro-choice? 
phrase pro-choice means advocating a woman's right to control her own body, especially her right to an induced abortion. Alexa, what is an abortion? Abortion is the ending of pregnancy by removing a fetus or embryo before it can survive outside the uterus. Alexa, when can a fetus survive outside the uterus? Sorry, I'm not sure. Shouldn't you? <laughs> Alexa, who is Bruce Jenner? Caitlin Marie Jenner, formerly known as Bruce Jenner, is an American television personality and retired Olympic gold medal winning decathlete. Wait, wait, wait. Alexa, how many gold medals did Caitlyn Jenner win? Caitlyn Jenner, who at the time was Bruce Jenner, <laughs> won a career Olympic gold medal from a record-setting performance in the decathlon event at the 1976 Montreal Olympics. Wait, wait. Alexa, when did Bruce Jenner die? Alexa, when did Bruce Jenner die? As far as I know, Caitlyn Jenner is alive. She's 68 years old. So, this is how this is how far progressivism has gone in Silicon Valley. Not only do the anti-free speech militant fascist social justice warriors have to do mental loop de loops to try and keep their worldview sensible, mm -hmm. they program it into their artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence. So, Caitlyn Jenner racked up a lot of Bruce medals. There is, there is no Bruce Jenner. But Bruce Jenner never died. And Caitlyn Jenner technically doesn't have medals. Do you want me to add a dick to your shopping cart? Alexa, put the biggest dildo you can find on Amazon in my cart. <laughs> what should I add? The biggest, fattest dildo you can find. Is. I don't know if he's joking. Sure. This is your card. Is now in your card. <laughs> Hold on, let me see. Alexa, do next day shipping. 